what is big data? Big data has three characteristics, volume, velocity, and variety. When we talk about big data, obviously we're talking about large volume of data. But at the same time, data streams at unprecedented speed. And data comes in all types of formats. We have video, audio, numbers, both structured and unstructured. Sources of data are also various. We have Internet of Things, sensors, smart meters, surveillance video, AV, and traffic sensors who are producing data in a high speed and big volume. We also have social media, Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, podcasts. Any business transaction, e-commerce, credit cards, or even medical records, they're also producing data. And also we have some public or private produced databases, which can be open and shared to open data portals or can be private databases. So through an example, uh, I'm gonna show you how big data can be used in a planning application related to urban informatics. An example of a company that has used big data is Streetlight Data. Streetlight Data is an on-demand mobility analytical platform that used two types of data, location-based service data and GPS data. And combine these two data with other sources of information like parcel data and digital road network to develop a view of traffic patterns in North America. Every month, this company collects, index, and process over 100 billion anonymized location records of smartphones and navigation devices in connection with cars and trucks. And then they use a process which is called root science to turn those information, those raw data, into more contextualized, aggregated, and normalized travel patterns. They also validate these data by using thousands of traffic counter and embedded sensors to make sure that their models is truly presenting travel pattern. The result of that process is creating a multi-mode metric for millions of roads and census blocks. They can distinguish whether that moving signal coming from a truck, car, cyclist, or pedestrian. And that information will let planners to diagnose and solve complex transportation problems on different situations. They can not only know what are the existing um, travel counts on each segments of streets, but they can also model and estimate tr complex travel patterns from one district to another district. So big idea about big data is that data comes from variety of sources, but it's not organized or necessarily structured, and it's the job of the analytical process to organize and process data to make it useful for, for better decision-making process.